This book was published in 1981. Someone sent this to me. These images I'm going to show you. The Eyes of Darkness by Dean Koontz. 1981. New York Times number one bestseller. Remember this book, y'all. You might want to order it. This book has predicted, or the author has. Let me start here at the top on page 312. A bacterial infection resembling the flesh eating disease of several years ago will arrive in 2010. Transmitted to humans by almost microscopic mites, undetectably imported on exotic birds, known medications and antibiotics. will be completely ineffective against this fungus-like, extremely contagious disease. And its victims will be quarantined until it's discovered that the bacteria can be destroyed through some combination of electrical currents and extreme heat. Then it goes to 2020 in this book. In around 2020, a severe Pneumonia-like illness was spread throughout the globe, attacking the lungs and the bronchial tubes and resisting all known treatments. Almost more baffling than the illness itself would be the fact that it would suddenly vanish as quickly as it arrived. It will attack again years later and then disappear completely so according to this book we're in the first round it's going to go away and then come back Wuhan 400 is called because it was developed at their RDNA labs outside the city of Wuhan and it was the 400th viable strain of man-made microorganisms created at that research center. Wuhan 400 is a perfect weapon. It afflicts only humans. No other living creature can carry it. And like syphilis, Wuhan 400 can't survive outside a living human body for longer than one minute. which means it can't permanently contaminate objects or entire places the way anthrax or other vir virulent microorganisms can. When the host expires, the Wuhan 400, within him perishes a short while later. As soon as the temperature of the corpse drops below 86 degrees Fahrenheit, so 
according to this book and the author, this virus cannot live outside the human body. It's here for 2020. It will disappear and it will come back years later. Again, here's the book, Dean Kuntz, The Eyes of Darkness. Published 1981.